I would think that this war um, conducted by Russia against Ukraine, in Ukraine, can actually not be, not at all be in the Chinese interest. Uh, why is China not um, taking a decision to demonstrate to us in Europe that China is actually on our side? China doesn't favor this war. China respects sovereignty. Let's have a new Minsk moment. Welcome to CCG Global Dialogue. I would think that this war um, conducted by Russia against Ukraine, in Ukraine, can actually not be, not at all be in the Chinese interest. It is strengthening the U.S. global role. It is strengthening NATO. Uh, China doesn't like NATO. Many, many statements have been made by the Chinese leadership about NATO. Um, so my question is, uh, why is China not um, taking a decision to demonstrate to us in Europe that China is actually on our side and that China wants peace and that China will talk to the Russians about the wisdom of ending this war rather sooner than later in order to go back to business and to go back to a more harmonious relationship. So explain to me why China is not using this opportunity more. I think the Chinese reputation, the perception that China, that, that China would create of itself among European elites would change quite dramatically if China came across as a power of, you know, conflict resolution rather than sitting on the fence. So I think that message has been quite clear that China doesn't favor this war. China respects sovereignty. The only difference is uh, China doesn't want to have these uh, sanctions. That's probably the difference. The thing for that is that China, as President Xi told the President Biden, you know, China and the U.S. are two largest economy. We will be held responsible for the stake of the global economy, and we don't want to see a recession uh, uh, on top of a pandemic caused by this Ukraine, Ukraine war. Because, for example, 70% of China energy depends on the import, and this energy crisis drive up by this Ukraine war going to cost China billions, if it's not trillions, and also the food crisis. So that's probably the difference. But I think you know China would like to work with the international community. For example, why not Chancellor Charles, the French President uh, Macron, and uh, Chinese leadership and the U.S. Let's have a new Minsk moment. You know, let's have seven party talks, P5 plus, plus Ukraine plus EU and, uh, and, and the UN. China would really like to work. I think Munich Security Conference could invite uh, seven parties to talk. And let's have a, have a peaceful way of out of that. You can, you can really organize that. Have, maybe next time we could have a talk in, in Beijing or something. I mean, you've been just in Washington. So, so uh, as far as I know, I think China would love to uh, you know, uh, see a peaceful end on that and not favoring this uh, 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 Russian called a special military operation. No, I don't think China is favoring that.